Hello, I'm Daniel, and welcome to the Imona Project. We here at the Imona Project are continuing in our series of videos with respect to education, information, inspiration, guidance, advice. And uh, those of you who have seen uh, a lot of my videos uh, know that I'm, a, I'm attracted and it catches my eye whenever there's an unusual wording or phraseology. And uh, I can't help but notice that throughout the... Uh, um, most of the Torah, especially when God is commanding Moses to do something, uh, sometimes it will say, uh, commanded something to Moses, and then sometimes it will say, to him. To Moses, to him, it's the same thing. So why it is in, in one case it says to Moses, and one time it says uh, to him? And can we learn anything from the distinction between the two? Because it's the same guy. It was um, Harav Elchanan Wasserman who says that there's a distinction between Moses the man and Moses the uh, leader, uh, the greatest of the prophets, the leader of the Jewish people. Moses himself didn't attribute a lot of significance to his role as, uh, as the leader of the Jewish people because, as the Torah tells us, he was the most modest of men. But we need to distinguish between the individual and his position. The story is told of the Mashgiach of Baranovitz. This is uh, Yisroel Yaakov Lubchensky. He was a Mashgiach at a yeshiva. Now, a little bit of an, of an aside here. A mashgiach at a yeshiva, at a rabbinical school, is not the same as a, as a mashgiach like me, a kosher inspector in a restaurant or at a food processing plant or a meat processing plant or a cheese plant. A mashgiach at a rabbinical school, a, a, a mashgiach at a yeshiva, at an institute of Jewish learning for boys. This is a, a rabbi who is given the responsibility for the non-academic aspects uh, of the student's uh, life. He takes care of the students, he gives them uh, guidance, advice, he takes care of the, uh, the boys, he takes care of the, the young men in their personal lives. A story is told of the Mashgiach of Baranovitz, um, Yisroel Yaakov Lubchensky. The rabbi was very ill, gravely ill. Uh, Rav Elchanan, who was the Rosh Yeshiva, came to visit him. He's supposed to visit the sick. He walks in, and the Rebetzin, the Mishkiach's wife, lamented the fact that her husband, Rav Yisrael Yaakov Lubchensky, the Mishkiach, refused to allow his students. He, he would not permit his students to assist him in any way, he was sick, but he wouldn't let the boys, he wouldn't allow the boys help him in any way. And um, Rav Elchanan um, mused, he thought, I don't understand. Perhaps for himself, he may not want to take advantage of the student's help. But what about the mashgiach? What about his role as mashgiach? He needs the students to help him so that he can recuperate more quickly from his illness. Indeed, the mashgiach should see to it that the mashgiach gets better. Since the yeshiva, the school, badly needs the mashgiach. In other words, the rabbi as an individual fine, you know, that's one thing. A person's sick, you take care of him. But in his role as the, 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 the boy's uh, guide and advisor, that position, that person, as it were, that person needs to get better. That person needs to have the students help him so that he can return to that position uh, at, the, at the school, making a distinction between the individual, and his position. And he used, to back up his argument, the Rosh Yeshiva, the head of the school, used to 
to, to, uh, to back up the argument, this very idea of how Moses viewed himself. <clears throat> it's this outlook. You need to distinguish between an individual and his position, <clears throat> excuse me, and his authority. This is the outlook of one whose attitude is molded by a Torah uh, perspective. When you have a position of authority, when you have a position of responsibility, it's not just you, the person. That position, um, it's almost like a separate person. And you can't think of it as the same way. Oh, I don't want somebody help. Mazel tov, you don't want somebody help. But what about your position as uh, the dean of a school? That person needs help because the school needs him. Um, it's uh, in common parlance, we talk about people wearing different hats. Um, okay, my, 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 uh, my position as a meshgiach, my position as a father, my position as whatever. There are, these are different aspects, different facets of yourself. And we, um, we need to view them in the proper perspective. We're going, to be giving, uh, we're going to be doing more videos along these lines. Please come back, please watch, please learn. And until next time, on behalf of the Immuno Project, I'm Daniel, and thank you too much.